When it comes to games that represent the NES best, it would be difficult to pick any other games over these two absolute classics. Today, join Steven, Jacob, and myself, Brandon, as we find out which one of these NES All-Stars moves forward into the final round for a shot at the title of champion. It's Mike Tyson's Punch-Out versus Duck Hunt on this episode of Video Game Fight Club. Punch-Out versus Duck Hunt. Where do we even begin with this? These are two totally different games. Uh, we kind of talked about it a little bit previously that Punch-Out is... So it's a sports game, but it's really kind of a puzzle game. It's as a fighting far. game, early uh, fighting, recognizing reads. patterns, reacting to them. We've talked about it. Mm -hmm. um, it's a Souls like. And then I can't Duck Hunt. Duck Hunt beat Final Fantasy. Wow. Yeah, I can't believe that, Steve. I can't believe that it who, won. Who made that last vote? I don't know. It's really weird. <laughs> Strange how that happens. Anyway, Duck Hunt. <laughs> <laughs> Duck the Hunt. Zapper. The Duck Zapper. Hunt. This is the only light gun game, uh -huh. and I think we did make some very valid points. Wait, you're not counting the super scope. <clears throat> Wait, what? You're not counting the super scope. What would I say? This is the only light gun. This is this the only this is the only light gun game. I thought you were making a joke. Oh, no, super yes. scope. Sucks. No. <laughs> that kind of does. Is that why you made me have the super scope in our first picture? You no. picked it. Yeah, you, I picked you it. did pick yeah. it. But it is. It looks really. It looks sure about that. I mean, they. It does look pretty good. I hope he puts a graphic. It, it works all right. It's anyway, right. Uh, we do need to do a new one though. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. Right. Uh, so the only light gun game on the NES. Yes. Uh, it's very easy to understand. You see a duck, you shoot a duck. Yeah. Dude, yeah. It comes with the accessory. You have the zapper. You, bling. You shoot the duck. It falls. Mm -hmm. And yeah, they have skeet shooting and stuff like that too. Yeah. But that, that, that punch out effect. punch out is a much more involved and I'd be willing to say younger audiences might struggle with yeah, game did. as far as gameplay. I did. I never, I never yeah. beat it. It's a hard game. Dude, Mike Tyson at the end Sucks. of Mike Tyson's punch out is uh, he will go down in history as one of the hardest bosses ever. I mean Dark Souls eat your heart out. He's the greatest boxer of all time. Dark Souls get your ear bit off. <laughs> Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Man, don't, 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 don't hurt us. Don't hurt us. Ain't nobody want to play with Dark Souls. I, I, I'm not doing it. I love Mike Tyson. <laughs> oh, dude, I love Mike Tyson too. He's probably watching this right now. If Mike Tyson <laughs> punched me out, I, you know, I'd probably die. But if I survive, uh, if I survive, got yeah, I gotta be. Yeah, I could probably survive it. <laughs> Old. Hey, sometimes whenever I'm doing the zoom in, it's hard. Jacob, what did I do? So, sometimes when I'm doing the zoom in, it's hard for me to, to frame Steve's yeah. head. <laughs> yeah, I'm just kidding. That face capture box can't I'm kidding, not kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding, but I'm not kidding. Anyway. Uh, I, I know, um, well, so because it's the semifinals, we've already kind of talked these games Yeah, we talked about all this uh, stuff. Let, but to compare them directly. Yeah. That's going to be fun because these are two totally different games. Yeah, so I think. Like, totally. I think picking them up right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Me personally, I love Punch Out. I can pick up Punch Out and sit there and play it till I can't play anymore. I usually I do that every now and again. I, like when I when I caught, uh, caught the gameplay footage. Yeah, I played it until I died, and then once I lost, I turned it off. I was like, I'll come back later. As and I can do that over and over again because I love I love Punch Out. As simple as it is, it's got a pretty compelling story. <laughs> I'd that. be willing to say, uh, uh, bear with me here. Uh, okay. I'd be willing to say that the replay value for um, Duck Hunt is unlimited because it's like score oh, yeah. attack. Oh, yeah. But also, I feel like it's more of an adventure and experience going back to Punch Out and trying to reach to the top because with Duck Hunt, the ducks just get faster. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they get faster. And you get different opponents, and you do get rematches too, I believe. Um, but you're constantly having to learn these new characters and adapt to them that way instead of just adapting to the speed. So I think Punch Out's a little bit more unique in that manner. Would yeah. you agree? Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. And here's another thing. All right, do, do we want to go down the list just in case audio? We gotta talk about the story. All right, you're playing Duck Hunt. You're hunting with your dog. You shoot ducks. He gets them. He makes fun of you when you miss. Punch out! You're playing as Little Mac, rising up through the ranks of the most. I shouldn't have said the that. Most, <laughs> this is this story, dude. Yeah, I cheating. I, can't lie. I just gave Brandon like the most I'm dirty. I gave him the spread shot. The most dirty opponents, and you're yeah. rising your way to the top to face off against one of the greatest athletes of all time. All one of the, time. One of the greatest boxers of all time. All time. The odds are against you. You are small and you're weak, but you can overcome your weaknesses and you can face greatness. And that's something that Punch-Out teaches you yeah. as a young child is that it doesn't matter how heavy the obstacle is. You can overcome it. Don't, don't, just because you're the little guy doesn't mean you can't rise through the ranks. 
Oh and yeah, be- give it to him, Matt. And become the champion. That was really good, Steve. Thank, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, you touched my chocolate bars. So I believe Punch Out has the better story. <laughs> All that being said, but it's funny though. It's funny though. As simple I mean, as it I can't is, argue with as, it. Simple, there, as simple as simple as it is, no story. It is a better story. Uh, I mean, it is a pretty good story for an NES game in general. Like they don't do any storytelling, but what NES game does storytelling? I mean, basically, like Brandon said, you start off Lil Matt rising his way up the minor circuit, major circuit. Next thing you know, he end up ring with Mike freaking Tyson. I know a game that does storytelling on the NES. Oh God. <laughs> Is that why you butt hurt about it? But, but hurt about it. I butt hurt about it. <laughs> but hurt about it. No, no, I'm, just, I'm just kidding. But anyways, uh, uh, are we gonna? I mean, do we want to kind of look, look. Punch uh, Out's got better music. Oh, without a doubt. Because oh, Duck Hunt doesn't have, have music. It doesn't even have music. It's got some iconic audio. It's got some iconic audio. That dog laughing's iconic. It is iconic. But you know what else is iconic? TKO. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, rap. Or like even the... Or yeah. the... Yeah. Or whenever, whenever someone uh, yeah, is they, about to do like a... Yeah. Yeah. The, the, the one like, that you hit they, when he drops they, his pants. Look, Punch like Out's got some great sound effects down. too. It's got some great sound effects. Uh, yeah, yeah, but I gotta go with Duck Hunt for the sound effects. Oh, whenever you get knocked out... That was really loud. Sorry about that. That was. You know what I'm talking about? Or whenever you hit whenever you hit Don Flamenco and he's like... You know what I'm talking about? That's, That's pretty good. That's a pretty good... You know what I'm talking about, too. I do. I can't it's argue with any of effect. this. I can't argue with any of this. I'd be willing to say that the sound effect of pulling the trigger on the zapper is more iconic <coughs> than the sound effects in Duck Hunt. Like, clang, clang, clang. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Even if yeah, uh, even okay. if your gun doesn't work, you still have that, that <coughs> motor. <coughs> yep. Oh, man. I think, I think Punch... I think Punch Out's got it in the audio department. That's my opinion. That's my opinion. Mm, mm. Yeah. I don't know, man. Only because it has more of it. It has more of yeah, it. Yeah, no, and I understand you're thinking, it's just, man, those Duck Hunt sounds are so iconic in, in and of itself. You know, I, I'm kind of torn. I don't want to give it just because of the quantity. Uh, you know, I kind of want to give it because of the the quality. And honestly, I think I think Duck Hunt's got a better audio in my opinion. It's just, it just stands out to me more. I don't know if it stands out to me more because it's, I, swear, I just played the crap out of it as a kid, and now my son plays the crap out of it, and my nephews. But you'd be willing to say you got a closer bond with Duck Hunt than Oh, 100 percent. That's why I'm trying to put the bias aside Look, because I'll be honest. because I do think that music-wise, sound song-wise, yes, definitely. Punch I'm gonna be out. honest. Punch Out is like probably my my. It's definitely my top 10 NES games of all time. Yeah. I don't know if it's in the top five, but it might be. Mm, it might be. It's I not really in the top five. I really like Punch Out. I'd be willing to say I probably yeah. like playing Punch Out more than playing Final Fantasy One. Ooh, ooh. Well, yeah. It's just a more I interactive. I love. Yeah, you're. I well, love the. Well, I love the skill. Like I love the. Man, it just really teaches you how to adapt, right, man. Yeah. Right, right. There's a reason I'm so good at reading patterns. Like when we play uh, Smash, look, I am so good at reading that stuff. I ain't gonna argue with that. He's, I can see it coming from a mile away. I got to know King Hippo. I got to know his smell. God. <laughs> I hope that, that sniff is in there. The listeners see it. They, oh, they, they know they're gonna they see it. Uh, <laughs> well, they're gonna see it. They're gonna see it. Right, I've gotten a lot. Of, I've gotten a lot of feedback about those zooms. I'm just saying. All right. What's revolutionary? Duck hunt. Gotta be duck hunt. I mean, it's duck hunt. Can't. I, it's duck hunt. That's why. That's why I asked. Duck hunt. I don't know you can say. Duck hunt, man. <sighs> Mm, what, do you, right. what do you think? What's the test time? Just random, just random duck question. Hunt. Random question. Oh. Do you think the Duck Hunt arcade game is more fun than the home game? No. The home game. Which one? Every like, time I've ever tried to play the arcade version of Duck Hunt, it's been broken. The arcade <laughs> game with the little revolver, you always been broken. Oh, yeah. Um, do, you, do you think the home version is better than the arcade version? I think the version? home version is better. Now, this is a stupid question, and it might come up. Can well, you I thought play... you were calling Brandon's question No, stupid. can you play the light gun on, on a... Um, Compo- uh, com- I say composite HD component TV? TV? HD? No, it's got to be. It's got to be CRT. CRT. Yeah. Oh, see that I was I was gonna say because I am fortunate I have a CRT TV that my son can experience that, but I didn't have it. Yeah, you're like I can't play Duck Hunt. He on can't that. play it. Mm-hmm. Now, is that a, is that a drawback? Does that take away? Let, or, or, or are we gonna talk that like? If, okay, matter of fact, because that kind of bleeds into the stand the test of time. Well, yeah, I mean, if, if we're talking about stand the test of time, sometimes I talk about re-releases on this category because 
You know, Punch Out. Because Punch Out is a great NES game. It's test time. The it's latest so Punch Out game was on the Wii, and it was really good. Yeah. Um, so well, that franchise got Duck Hunt hasn't made a reappearance until Smash Brothers. Yeah. yeah. And I would say Duck Hunt, like if if you have the hardware, Duck Hunt Duck Hunt totally stands test time. I would say almost a little better, just because it's just easy. Like you said, it's easy to pick up. There's not really a skill level aside from a score attack, and you put you go two ducks. Okay, and now you're on like level yeah. ten. And they're just moving around like this, but. Like, you kind of have to have the hardware. I think this is going to bleed into the iconicness category a little bit. Yeah. Because they're they're both super iconic. But, yeah, because I mean, the console. I think Duck Hunt's more iconic, but I mean... Agreed. Who, who do you know that plays NES that doesn't know what Mike Tyson's Punch-Out is? Yeah, yeah. A lot of people know what it is. And some people don't even know that they're that Mike Tyson lost... They lost the license with Mike Tyson and it became a Punch-Out featuring Mr. Dream. I would counter that with, I think, I think Duck Hunt's got the grandma appeal. We always oh, use the yeah, grandma yeah. argument, the, the wee grandma ah, argument. Son, let me shoot those ducks. Yeah. It's easy. Look, Everybody I'm, can do it. My brain is smooth, and I don't know how to play a game. It's just Granny. Bling, 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 bling. I wish this was a podcast. That's Granny Smooth Brain. Is that Granny? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not, I'm not making fun of anybody's a, grandma. Someone take that for a, uh, for a screen name. I'm just saying. Big I'm, boomer I'm just, energy <laughs> over here. <laughs> Granny Smooth Brain 02. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, I don't, yeah, that's a tough it, one. I think you could argue this both ways. Yeah, I feel mm-hmm. like I feel like the. I mean, we don't have it up here, but I feel like like because it, it came with the console, it was yeah. released. It was. Uh, right, right, we're talking. We're the, talking Mount Rushmore of NES yeah, games. You yeah. see, you're gonna see a duck up there. You're yeah. gonna see Mario up there. Yeah. Are you gonna see Mike I don't Tyson? Think so. I don't there. Think you see Mike I, don't think so. I don't think you see Lil Mac. You, well, you definitely don't see Mike Tyson because all right, of all right, right, you, got, you got five seconds. To name the four that you put on your Mount Rushmore. Go. Oh, good. Okay, Mario, uh, the Duck Hunt. I'm gonna say crap. Four seconds. That's uh, 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 uh. Is dang Ma- it. Is, is Mega it, Man going up there? Is Mega Man. Kirby. Is Kirby going up there? Kirby's going up there, and Link. Steve. Link, Mario, Kirby, and uh, Samus. Ooh. He didn't say a duck. He didn't put the duck on there. Well, is is Tyson? Oh, okay. wait. Who's on no, your no, Rushmore? He didn't, he didn't, he didn't put the duck on there. Who's on your Rushmore? Shoot. My Rushmore. No, is... I put the duck up there. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're right. He didn't put the duck. He didn't put the duck. Who's on your Rushmore? I'm gonna do Mario. I'm uh-huh. gonna do. Ah oh, man. I wouldn't put Mike Tyson, but I would put Little Mac, and I would put Link, and I would probably put. Good duck. I'd put Samus probably. Uh, I don't know. I, don't I know. think I'd take Kirby off and put the No duck Kirby. On mine, I'm going Kirby with that one. I'm going Kirby with that one. <sighs> I think I I think I'd take Kirby off and put the duck up there, to be honest with you. But you still got the duck and no mic. Right. So is it time to vote? Oh man, it's a, it's a no takes you can't triple stamp a double stamp. You can't triple stamp a double stamp, Steve. You can't triple stamp a double stamp. I'm just saying. Uh, alright, so mechanic- No, but I but I, in all honesty though, like I feel like I feel like uh Duck Hunt is one of the ones that you really, really gotta have to it- Represent the console because, no. like, like Jacob said, a lot of Nintendos came with the Super Mario Duck Hunt Snake Rose combo, and so up there somewhere. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And so, like, that's how a lot of people got their got their entrance mm. into the NES. The only reason I'm arguing really hard for Punch Out is because I, I know I'm the only one here who has like a lot of Punch Out. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I think you're, I, 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 I think I'm, it's I'm, great I'm, because I honestly don't know my decision. Well, <laughs> you were you were making a lot of arguments. I was like, that gum, he's got some fuel. That gum, I gave him fuel. <laughs> Um, all right, are we voting? Yeah. I'm Is it vote time? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, I mean, I have it. I'll Steve, go Steve, 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 go, go first. first. Steve, go first. Okay. So or I can go first. Ooh. My vote, I'm going to go first. Okay. So I'm going to tell you right now, my vote changed like five times. <laughs> mine, like, I still have mine. In, in this episode, just now, it went back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Yeah. Every time we went through a different category, it was just back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. But the fact is, man, is that when you think of the NES... And you're not thinking of any of the big names. Duck Hunt comes to play, and I gotta go with Duck Hunt for that. Mm-hmm. Because Duck Hunt, the, the and and I will be totally honest with you. This is another razor thin margin for me. Okay. Yeah. But the thing that set it apart is the fact that it is iconic. That zapper. People are making handguns, real handguns that look like that zapper. Hey, I don't recommend hey, it. Is that a good I don't thing? recommend it. Is that a good thing? I mean, no, but <laughs> I don't recommend I it because he, it looks I like see, a child's I see toy. What he's saying. Uh, but but man, the, I, the just the, the soul iconicness. I mean, that duck. You put that duck anywhere, you're gonna know where that duck's from. Mm-hmm. You put that dog anywhere, you're gonna know where that dog. I don't know from. the duck so much. The dog, dog yes. Sure. I don't know about the duck. Well, I'm talking about the, the, the pixels, the actual pixels of the ducks. Yeah. Because I mean. 
Well, I mean, obviously, Steven. I mean, hey, Doug Hunt Mario. also Doug, Doug Hunt also had the uh, the secret multiplayer mode that no one knew about until like a couple years ago. Yeah, exactly. yeah, holy crap. Yeah, yeah. But I'm not gonna count that because nobody knew about that. In my, you know, yeah, I, in my opinion, right, right, I don't know. I'm gonna vote for oh, no. Oh man, uh, man, I'm gonna vote. <laughs> you know what? Just just for the sake of an argument, Do it. I'm gonna vote punch out. Do it. I'm gonna okay. vote punch out. I just, dude, I think about the most frequently played NES in, for me, mm -hmm. for my bias. Mm -hmm. Punch. I always play Punch Out, man. I love that yeah. game. I, I love to just pop it in, and like I said, I go until I just I, I die. Sometimes I die at Ball Bull because I missed. I, I take that chance. And I miss and I, I threw it all away. Sometimes I play more carefully. Uh, I like playing that game. It's a good game. It, it is. is. I, dude. It is. I really think it's probably my top five NES games. I really love Punch Out, man. It's, I it's, wish it feels I'm, it feels so good to play, I, I, and that's about the, both these games feel really good to play. It feels good. I think it feels just as good. I don't know about that. I think it feels it feels better to nail that bald bull shot, for mm -hmm. example, or to nail that weakness than it does to shoot a duck that's just going a little faster. I think that's my biggest. Vote. Yeah, and I understand I, that, <laughs> but it's wrong. So I wish eight. Ooh, I wish eight or nine year old. No, you're right. I'm not cussing. You're right. Eight or nine year old Jacob. I wish I had the patience that you had playing it when you were a kid, because <laughs> I think it would have made me a, a better gamer. Because it, it did. It, it trained oh, you some really yeah. iconic skills that you can carry on through the through the, through the years and into your adult life. Hey. Like you said, learning how to read. I just had the patience for it. I'm gonna go. This is where I land, and it, it it's. I'm going back to. I'm a, I, I like to put myself, and I've used that coin that term on this podcast. I like to go ahead and take credit for it, copyright. But John Q. Gamer, I just like talking to. I talk to a lot of parents at my school, or people in the gym, and people that like don't game anymore, but you say, you know, yeah, man, I used to play on the Nintendo. Now I say, I used to play on the Nintendo. You don't know what they're talking about. They just they maybe talk about NES and SNES, but they always talk about a game we might talk about in a minute. And they always talk about Duck Hunt. I remember I got Duck Hunt. Now they just they, they bring it up. Whether they ever played very much, it was just something they grew up. It was iconic to them, and it really it's kind of going back to the contra. It's the it's the heyday lands with Duck Hunt. It's not just because it well, came we've, with the we've console. Already, we've already, as a group, came to the decision that technical prowess has nothing to do with it. Yeah, at, like at this point. So yeah, I, I just I have to vote Duck Hunt. I, it's I just, just it's just it's just plain old dang old fun. I just plain think old dang old fun. I think if we're talking, you're both smooth brains. I think if we're talking about the NES, this specific Fight Club, going for this console, I just don't see a world where you can't put Duck Hunt. I agree. In it. I agree. As, right. as a top oh, contender. I agree. Doug Hunt wins again. That's three times. It's mm -hmm. going to the finals. Doug Hunt moves forward in the final matchup of the series. Will it continue on its winning streak, or will it miss its shot at the title of champion? Subscribe so you don't miss the final showdown. Does anybody back me up that Punch-Out should have won? Tell us how you feel about these two games in the comments down below. And as always, like the video and share this show with everyone you know. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the final episode.